Yeah. Yeah, they... That's how I feel, man. That's how I feel. If I haven't talked, if I didn't talk to a female for four years and she doesn't even know my name, and a bitch made motherfuckers around her twenty four seven, and he can't get her to look at me a quarter mile down the street with sunglasses and all that shit without acting like a bitch and getting, you know, that's that's some bitch made shit. Of course. Like and when you're inside your house, when you're even talking to me, not through the cell phone, I'm not talking about these bitches with the mouse show on the cell phone. Uh, yeah, you know, but I'm talking about the, the in your house. You know, when you're when you're doing your business, like going reading books or researching. I, I bet they can hear every tap you make on your computer. Probably. But the thing about it is they got all that shit and they can't make a girl come and look at me in the eyes. These bitch-made motherfuckers got all this shit, and they can't make a girl come... These bitch-made motherfuckers got all this punk-ass, fake-ass, ho-ass shit, and they can't make a a 21-year-old young woman come look a motherfucker in the eye. She hasn't talked to him in four years, and he doesn't even know her name. Bitch-ass shit. Yeah. She's talking to everybody else. Right. She's talking to everybody else. And they don't want her to talk to me, but she can't even come look me in the eye because she wants to be with me so much. And these punk bitch made motherfuckers don't know what to do about it. And they're getting frustrated. They don't, you know, like, they don't know what you're capable of, man. They know they're supposed to be spying on you, so they're looking at it like, damn, who is this motherfucker? You know? Like, they don't know what you're capable of. Right. So they gotta come out at night and hide behind fences and all that punk shit. Yeah. They gotta hide in bathrooms and shit, ride by on bikes and say shit. <laughs> you know what I mean? And play songs and shit when you walk in stores. Coming by, you know, and then saying like weird ass shit when they they come. 
Yeah. This bitch yeah. made that shit, man. They got like 20 fucking layers of shit just for one motherfucker. They need a game, dude. They can't do it themselves. And whatever they can do, they still can't do it. Shit, they're not using the game against you, man. They got fucking NASA. They're using NASA against you. That's what it sounds yeah. like. They, they got NASA technology and shit they're using against you. They, they're using, they're using, you know, fucking Deep Space Nine Star Trek shit against you. They're using shit. Like, they, <laughs> they, I also read about it, too. Uh, other people have experienced this before. You know what's coming out of your mouth. They already know what's coming out of your mouth. Like, not now, but, like, when I can saw it or keep thinking and reading, it's, like, all have a mimic of what they're saying. And it, it's actually what I'm saying. <laughs> that, shit, that, that shit tripped me the fuck out. How you said you, you walked outside and your neighbor was saying the stuff you were thinking before you even said it. That that shit that shit that shit that's like the, the hey man that's that's like that's like fucking like so some polar guys fucking Friday the Thirteenth uh Candyman Deep Space Nine. Illuminati, you know what I mean? Like that's some motherfucking stuff for you, boy, right there. That's some, that's beyond gang stalking. I don't know what that is. That that that's kind of tripping me out. Man, it, that that's some fucked up. You got some stuff. That, I don't know how they're do, they're they're running they're running some game. They're man, I don't know, man. You might be like a super soldier or something. You just don't know about it. You might have, you might have, you might have been in some secret project and shit. And you just don't have the memories of it, man. I don't know, man. All I know is I don't even have to speak. I can talk shit in my mouth. You know, how you speak in your mouth. You can talk shit 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 in your mouth. You can You're like Jason Bourne, man. You're like the Bourne legacy out here and shit. Oh, yeah. Don't do it. I can keep my mouth closed and talk shit and they know what I'm saying. <laughs> you 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 haven't you've been going off on motherfuckers though. <laughs> you've, you've, I don't care. Hey, hey, you you turned into a straight up G. You went you went from hiding in your house. You went from hiding in your house all day, and now you're out here walking up in stores and shit, calling motherfuckers out. You you're, you 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 turned up into a you're a straight up G, man. You're walking up on motherfuckers and, and, and call, tell them they're bitch made and shit, calling them out. <laughs> I'm calling them out, dude. Like, at that farm, they're like, ride your skateboard. I mean, they just let the people know what they're up there and it's just like, oh, it's worth it. Right. That's how I feel. I'd be calling motherfuckers out, boy. I mean, if they're capable of this bullshit, you know, and they want to try it, I, I think they're capable of it. What they want to do is they want to try to. I, I'm thinking of what. Remember that one thing I told you about that polar guy stuff, where that woman came home and her whole house, all the furniture was switched around and like chairs were stacked on top of each other on tables and shit. I don't recall that. Remember I told you that where the techers were there and one of them got the techers got scared and left because they they were like. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. They, they already had seen it before. Yeah, they were just like, fuck this. They were like, this is some paranormal shit right here. And fucking took off. <laughs> you know? He was like, don't call us, we'll call you. And took off. Don't call us. Don't call us. <laughs> yeah. Like, that's like, the, that's like your doctor. He's like, sitting there playing video games and shit. Like, what kind of drugs do you want? Yeah, what do you Yeah, we sure do. And you know, 
know what? Every time I turn on the radio, it's like they know that like I'm listening to the radio. <laughs> they know about it. Uh. Well, no, because I only listen to one channel, right? The rest are shit. In fact, Sacramento is the worst fucking radio stations I've ever, even the one I listen to. You know, and I, I love listening to it just for some rock, you know. When I don't want any pop or any of that shit, I'll listen to some 98 rock. And uh, it's a California station. And every time I'm on it, it's like they know that I'm fucking on it. And like they play songs like Nine Inch Nails that I like, Tool, Alice in Chains, and then like the little, the hitch trippy here. Like, I don't know. Yeah. That's fucked up. Star Trek shit, man. Yeah, that's the part that I don't get. It's like, they could have, like, with this technology, they could have done pirate hit, man. That's got to cut rid of me. But at the same time, I can keep my mouth closed. And people know, like, what I'm saying. You know, like, there's the, the EMF, you know, or they, they, just, they, they just know they're they that, and they, they partially got me brain mapped, like, It's otherworldly, other man. I could have hit the game stopped you, but the game stopping that I'm getting is uh, very different. You know, it's only, it's escalated. It went from me just being, uh, it went from me literally being scared and frightened and thinking that I was being exposed or being a bad boy, like a child molester or an arsonist or a criminal, you know, and, you know, I, I did have a criminal task, you know, when I was first here. But, like, you know, that's that's said and done. But, like, it's like they, I had thought that everybody was just labeling me as a bad person. I got scared of going out of the house. I got scared of doing things. I got scared. I was embarrassed by my own self. I would not walk on my, on my patio to smoke. I'd go in my garage and isolate and smoke cigarettes where nobody would be around me or see me. Now it's like, <laughs> it doesn't make any fucking sense, man. All these... <laughs> find some way to show him you're gonna you're gonna show him what do you know what man you should start putting I'm gonna your, play the marine motherfucker you can go back to army you should you should reflect the program back to them you should start gang stalking them man that's kind of what I like it's kind of what I do if I kind of go out and I figure out shit you know I go out and observe, observe shit you know and that's like I hear stuff, I start going towards them. I don't just like, br I brush it off, you know. And that, that's a good point how you brought up, like, only with 90% of it, you know, focus only on the, the 10%, like the, 
shit. I'll just walk up to that motherfucker and knock on the door and ask him for some peanut butter. And then when he opens the door, I'll just have a flashlight in my hand. Be like, shine the flashlight. Shine the flashlight at his fucking ass one time. And just be like, oh, never mind, and walk away. monitor people, you know, just to be monitoring them. They don't even know why they're monitoring. They're just monitoring, they're monitoring for everything. They even monitor motherfuckers, you know, dreams and stuff, whatever. You're already you know, doing it. You get where I'm getting at? Get from that? Yeah. Yeah, that's how every... every I do the same... Yeah, I, every day, every day, I make more improvements somehow. And, like, I'm way far ahead where I was even a week ago. And so, you know, I just look at it like, fuck these bitch-made motherfuckers. Yeah. <laughs> these motherfuckers are bitch-made. <laughs> they can't even get a 21-year-old girl who hasn't talked to a guy in, in four years and, and he doesn't even know her fucking name to fucking oh, come and look at him in the face in front of her own father in the house she grew up in on her own street. What the fuck? <laughs> That's some bitch, baby. These are some... There was a bunch of fucking fake m and and shit in a car going past you that she doesn't even know. Yeah, that makes perfect. Not even going past me, going past me a quarter mile down the street with like sunglasses and tinted windows and afraid to look in my direction and all this shit. 
Like a quarter mile down the fucking street, man. This is a bitch made ass shit. Man, I, I don't, you know, it is, dude. I mean, I don't care if it's bitch ass made shit or it's Mike Tyson or aliens from another world up in Mexico. Like, I'm at that point, dude. Like, I'm, I'm getting, like, evil eye, like, but, like, you know, thank God, like, uh, also, like, I mean, in a way, man, like, I live, uh, by full song. I mean, I live by full Present, which also is good, but I mean, I live by a beautiful, gorgeous river, you know, that I can go down into all of nature. There's nothing but nature down there, and, and like, you know, and, and uh, an awesome river, you know, and like, there's a, uh, you know, I used to kayak a lot, you know, somewhat, and I was, I was really good at it, and you know, I'm gonna be getting a kayak soon, and it's just like it's all nature, it's gorgeous, you know, you go under the and everything, you're in the middle of the forest, and like even just going to the library, which is down the street, and going in the park, you know, I find like, it's almost like I, I never really believed in a god before, but ever since like, like this has happened to me, it's morally destructive to me, but it's also made me find peace in myself, peace that I've never found, and inner confidence even if I've talked to you or not, dude, it, it's changed me in a positive way. And they want it towards make it negative, you know, towards me. And they do. So it's like, I found some inner strength in me that I thought I'd never have in my life. Right. It's almost making me a better skateboarder, too. I haven't skateboarded for five or six years. And now I'm saying, you know, I used to be like a professional skateboarder in Sacramento, known by everybody. And now, like, I, it went from barely being being able to skate, and now it's just like I'm, I'm cruising down the street going like 30 miles an hour, like fucking, you know, doing, like, popping up, like, learning my old tricks, and just like doing impossible and stuff. I hope that's some pro can't even do still. Yeah. You know? 